Welcome everyone, I'm Colby and today we're going to be doing a cooking adventure. We've done one mini cooking adventure when we did a Q challenge, but today I thought it would be fun if we went along and cooked every single recipe. So I don't think we're going to be able to do all of them in one video because there are quite a few recipes. So we're going to take it row by row and see maybe if we can finish one page today and a second page another day. But it really depends on how long it's going to take us to collect different um, recipe items, different ingredients, and um, different like fish. I think it's really the fish that's going to take us the longest. So maybe I should start by emptying my pockets out a little bit. Got all oopsies. I want to keep that actually. I've got a lot of random stuff around here. Um, I probably don't put these in there, but I think I put them in here. And if I don't, we're just gonna say yes for today. And then I put furniture items over here. Oop, that one's full. That one's almost full. Oops, I forgot about these guys. And I'm just gonna stick this here because it actually goes on my slime hutch. But I'm uh, reworking my slime hunch right now, so I just am kind of storing a lot of these here for now. Because I don't really know what to do with them quite yet. Okay, and I'll put these up here and then some other stuff. I think I'm also going to make another chest or two. Because... What do I even need for a chest? Let me see. There's one here, just wood. Are there any other cool chests, though? There's this one. A stone chest. No, I don't have a lot of stone. I'm gonna have to do wood. So let's go up here and I need to find a place to store all of my cooked items. I was gonna say I could do over here, but that's gonna block the way up here. Ignore those strawberries. They're not doing anything productive. I feel like here and here would make the most sense, but I have a lot of random food in here already. And I would need to probably stick that elsewhere. I kind of want to just like start start most things from scratch. If I can, I guess? I don't know. It might be kind of useful to use some of these. I was thinking I should either make maybe three of every item. Just so I have some extras if I need to give it away to somebody. But m maybe I'll only do two. I'm not sure now that I'm, now that I'm here. Now that I'm here, I don't know. Okay, maybe I'll just keep... I'll just look in here for reference sometimes when I need something. Bum ba dum Bum 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 Where do I want to put them? Where do I want my food chests? All my refrigerators look crazy! Down here, maybe? I do kind of want them over here, but... Maybe another time. I could put them in like the middle of the room, like down here, maybe? Ooh, I figured out how to turn the chairs. Oops. Nope. Maybe I didn't. I swear. Yeah, look. And then I go like this. Yes. Boom! Yeah, maybe I'll put a chest or two down here. Or maybe up here. Yeah, maybe I'll move the- oops. Maybe I'll move this table down. And the chair down, like one square. Maybe I'll put it like here. And then I could put a couple chests elsewhere. Look at me doing things. Boom! I'm becoming a pro at these controls. Well, let me get the wood again. Put it all away. I'm not gonna need some. I'm only gonna need two chests, so. Oops! My rug! Okay. Um, one, two. Okay. Then I could put the rest of my sticks back. I don't really want this coffee cup. I don't like it on that table either, so maybe I'll just put it in here. And I'll stick a chest here. And one there. That looks fine for now. I could change colors. Is that nicer? <laughs> I don't know. Maybe I'll make them, like, gray. Or maybe I can make them blue, like the floor. That's kind of cute, kind of funky. Okay, why not? Or, or maybe I can make it like stay with the pattern. I'm gonna make this one white. 
Ooh, okay, I don't really care. Now let's start. So I'm gonna start with this row and I guess let's do like, we'll start with three of every item and if that just turns out to be silly, then we can do less. But I want at least one of everything, right? So one, two, three. So fried egg, we just need one egg. Easy. An omelet, we need one egg and one milk. And it could be any kind of milk, like any size. So we have three. Nice. And there will be a few cooked items that use stuff like fried egg or bread. Salad, we need leek, dandelion, and vinegar. Three of them, nice. So we've already got the fried egg, the omelet, the salad, and we have this cheese cauliflower. So it looks like we're gonna need a lot more cheese pretty soon. Cheese cauliflower only has cauliflower and cheese, obviously. Big fish, okay, so we are gonna need some sunfish. Oh no, sunfish, look, here's the thing. Not every fish is in every season. And we can use magic bait, and I have a lot of uh, the Q gems, the purple ones, so I can buy them, but, uh, but I don't know how high of a chance I have to get it. Okay, let's not worry about that right now. We'll keep going down the line, but we know we're gonna need some baked fish. So parsnip soup. Oh, I'm gonna need more milk. I'm gonna need more milk. Maybe I should just get some now. Because I'm gonna need more for that one too. Ooh, things aren't looking so good. Okay, so I'm stopping at the parsnip soup and I'm just gonna go to my barn and collect maybe some eggs and the mayonnaise and stuff. And just keep all of it. Why not? And get all of this too. And then I'm gonna do the same with the milk. Nice, now I have a lot of eggs, a lot of milk, mayonnaise. Boom! Nice. Look at us go. Look at all those truffles. Boom. Okay, here's my milk. Oh! Okay. But I can do this if I wanted. I have another chest that sneaks into my house. Why not use it? It goes into my basement though, so not as convenient. But I think I can get the rest of this and not have to make two trips down here, which will be faster ultimately. Let's zoom over to my house. Maybe I should have just emptied my pockets a little bit more. Too late. So the other chest is down there, but I need to empty this out before I do anything else. So, let's get rid of these. And eggs. And I guess that's all the eggs we can fit there, but I can put some more in here for now. They don't usually go in this this one, but it doesn't really matter for today. Um, I just want to fill this random spot on the, the top of my pockets with something, so I'm just going to pick a strawberry. I'd rather have stuff go to the bottom row and not the top row. Okay, so here's the other chest I have. So... I am gonna steal all of this. Usually I save my cheeses for down here, but this is a good, a worthy sacrifice. We are where they, I wonder where, I wonder if I have any sunfish. Okay, parsnip soup. We have three of those now. Nice, and parsnip soup is just one parsnip, one milk, one vinegar. Now vegetable stew, one tomato, one beet. And we have enough ingredients for that too. So we've got all three. Then the complete breakfast. See, this is where things get a little tricky. So we're gonna need to make three fried egg, three hash browns, and three pancakes in order to make a complete breakfast. I wanna see if I have any in here already. Um, mum, 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 mum. Doesn't look like it. I have an omelet. Hello? I have... Oh, I do need the strange bun. Might as well get that one. Oops. Okay, so I got these. Okay, now I needed the hash browns and the pancakes. One, two, three, one, two, three. And I'll get three more of these because it's gonna take it from here. Nice. So now I have the complete breakfast. Fried calamari, I'm gonna need more squid. So I'm not even gonna get one right now. 
but I will make a note that I just need two of them. And the sunfish, I'm gonna need three total. Cause if you look, I don't have any of them. Oh. Hopefully I can catch three pretty easily. And now the strange bun, we only wanted three, four, but we got four, which I don't know, I'm not mad about. Now let's put everything in order. And then we had the big fish, so there's gonna be nothing there right now. Um, so next is the parsnip soup, the vegetable stew, where's that? Did I put it up here on accident? No. Oh. Did I just not make it? No, vegetable medley. Did I call it stew? Wait, that's interesting. This calls it vegetable stew. But this is vegetable medley. That is intriguing. So, let's just move on. Complete breakfast. Fried calamari we don't have, but we have the strange bun. And I kind of want three of everything, so I am going to take one of these. Let... Now, I think... I think maybe... Hmm... Because I'm, I'm, I'm like wondering if maybe we want to get all the fish from this row. I mean, all the other ingredients from this row. Or... Oh, look at that. Wait. <gasps> now... Ooh... Now I only need one sunfish. Nice. Okay, but I still need two of the squids. Well, okay. What's that? Glazed yams. So, let's see. Maybe we'll do two rows at once. So why don't we move on to this bottom row here. This one. And see how many things we can make from this. And then we'll go on a hunt for the items that we don't have. And things that we need to plant maybe. So, lucky lunch, we don't have anything. But we can make tortillas. Um, I think it's just wheat or, or corn. I think it's corn. Yeah. So, we're not going to worry about that right now because I don't want to keep... Well, nah, we're just going to leave that. But we need three sea cucumbers. And we're also going to need three blue jazz. Blue jazzy jazzy. Okay. Then we have fried mushrooms, so we, we need some more of this mushroom. Hmm, I think the best plan to get this is to just visit my cave on my farm and visit my cave on Ginger Island. So we'll try that first. And we can also check and see if I have any fried mushroom right now, because, I mean, there is a chance. Pizza, I can make three of that. Boom, okay, so I got three pizzas. And we have a bean hot pot. You know, I'm surprised I don't have any green beans. I usually have a plethora of them. Green beans. I might have them on my farm, though. But this one I'm going to need six of because this recipe takes two green beans. Glazed yams. I, are, I have some here because I remember looking at them. So I got one from there. Oops. One from there and two from here. Now I have three. So I got my glazed yams. The next one is a carp surprise. Oh my goodness. See, this is one where I'm not so sure we're gonna get three of them because I don't just need one carp for this. I need four, which means I'm gonna need 12. B-R-I-S-E, surprise. Now, what's next? Hash browns. And I can make three and three pancakes. Nice. Now what's next? We have the salmon dinner. So luckily I have the rest of the ingredients and I'm just gonna need to find some salmon and I only need one. That will be kind of hard actually. They're not very common. I remember one day I was fishing. I feel like I was fishing for days. So I'm not sure about, no, it was the tuna. Maybe it was the salmon too, but the tuna, oh my God. Do I have any fish tacos? Please. Nope. Not a single taco. Not a single taco. I'm gonna need the tortillas for that too, which will be easy. But it's really the tuna. So it's the second row that we don't have a lot of things for. 
I think it will be good to go on an adventure now and see how many of these we can get before moving on to the other rows. We can get a lot on the bottom. But this one might trip us up a little bit. Hmm, I don't know actually. You know what? Maybe I will do this row too. Should I do three at a time? Should I do three at a time? I don't know. But so far on my list, we need one sunfish, two squid, three sea cucumbers, three blue jazz, three moral, moral, moral mushrooms, six green beans, um, 12 carps. Oh my gosh. Three salmon and three tuna. So a lot of this is going to be fishing. Fishing activities. Now I'm going to put this mayonnaise and milk away. And the other ingredients that we've built up. So we have pizza first, I believe. No, it was the luck. Do we, do we even get lucky lunches yet? I feel like we had some. No, we don't. Okay. So pizza is the first one. The next one is the glazed yams. Then we have the hash browns. Where did my pancakes go? Didn't I make some pancakes? Where are they? What the heck? Any more? I could have sworn. What the heck happened to my what happened to my cakes? Cause after the hash browns are the pancakes. What the heck happened? Didn't didn't I make them? Well, I guess I'll find out. So let's go fishing. Do we have tackle? Yes, we have a good one. I like that one. It makes it a little bit bigger. And I have some bait. Oop. Oop, my farm's not looking too good. Ooh, it's not looking good. You know what? Let's see what fish I have over here. And maybe I could take some from some of these. All right, what's this fish? I forget. What are you called? Ice pip. We don't need any ice pip. Oops, I didn't mean to grab that. Ooh, I wish this was the sea cucumber that we needed. What are you? Sturgeon. We don't need any of this. Some of these I just got because I like the color. Okay, let's see if we can get anything from here, though. We don't need any hot peppers. We don't need any radish. Okay, come over here. We don't need any wheat or hay, either. Okay, well, we tried. Let's check my mushroom cave and see if we have anything in there that we can get. Ooh, yeah. Look how good it looks in here. I forgot. I love it. I should put more fish back here. Wow, divine. All right, so we did get one of those mushrooms that we need. Nice. We need three of them, though. So, mm, I guess I'll drop some stuff off since I'm home. I'm, like, right here. I don't know where I usually put my mushrooms. Because it doesn't really matter. Well, I kind of want to put the other ones where they should go. Oh, I think it's full. But maybe I have some already. Yeah, okay. do 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 I can put that away too. I got that from the fish pond. Ooh, I didn't put my baked fish away. I forgot that I had two of these. My baked fish. Bum. Well, that's gonna be out of order. I wonder if I, I'm kind of nervous, but well, that didn't work, did it? I was kind of trying to put them in order from the recipe list rows, but that ruined it, okay. Now, let me just drop off this row that I accidentally picked up. Or I can do this. And then we're gonna go over... Where are we gonna go? I'm trying to think about what's the... the best place to go fishing today. Hmm, probably the ocean. Probably the ocean. Well, I've kind of realized, oops, I've kind of realized that maybe I should have eaten something to make this a little bit better, but oh well. 
So, let's see. We have a few that are going to be in the river and a few that are going to be in the ocean. So, why don't we just go for the river first? But I want to go in the mountain. My horse is making it difficult. So, let's actually go up this way. I'm thinking. I'm sorry. I'm thinking a lot. I know I gotta go through that transition area up top, and then I think it will be considered the mountain river. Maybe. I don't know. But we'll try it. Up here. Okay. Or maybe this is only the lake. Whoa, look at everybody over here. Ooh, I think this is the lake. Okay, let me go back down a little. I think this is the river. That's fine. I'll just fish here. Maybe I'll go in the middle. Well, almost. I haven't been fishing in a little while. Whoa, it's almost off the screen! Because I'm up so high. On the map. Boom! And I don't need that. I don't need that fish. Oops, I went too far over. Maybe it'll be better if I go on this bridge. And I go this way. We'll see. We'll see. I'm feeling pretty good about where we are so far though with our food recipes. We have almost everything on the first row and half of the stuff on the second row I'd say. Not bad. So out of all of the fish that we have, the sunfish and the salmon. A sunfish! I got one! And I only needed one! Hey! Nice. So we're gonna be able to make all of the recipes on the first row now. Because we needed the sunfish for the big fish. Oh, we still need fried calamari though. We need more squid for that, but you get that in the ocean. So we'll probably go to the ocean another time. I think I need some green algae for something else, so I will probably keep that somewhere in my refrigerators, just in case. This feels kind of sunfish vibes. I don't need any more. A pike. Well, I was wrong, wasn't I? Oh, you know what? I can't even get a salmon right now because it needs to happen in fall. So why don't we abandon my horse and just go down to the ocean now? Because we need some... You know what? We need some squid and they only show up in the winter. So we're, I think we're gonna need magic bait. We're gonna need magic bait, which makes it so every fish from every season appears. Well, there you go. There you go. And if it gets way too difficult, we could probably make a fish pond on my farm and see if we can get some stuff like that. Um, I'll deal with that later. Yeah, I'll buy a ticket. I'll buy a ticket. Boop, 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 boop. So, I'm just gonna get some magic bait. And I'm thinking that at this point, it might be best to go through... I'm, I'm changing plans here. I'm kind of changing my plans. So, I know I'm gonna need magic bait because it's summer right now. And I'm gonna need it to be... Summer, spring, fall, and winter are all at the same time. Just to get all my fishies. So I think right now I'm going to focus on stuff that I can already make. Make all of it. And then write down what ingredients I still need. And then I can plant accordingly. Because I don't want to accidentally sell some fish or some plants or something that I need. And I also need to take time to let things grow. So... I don't want to like start planting some stuff now and then realize I need to plant stuff later. Alright. Magic bait. I'm gonna get- look see I have 197 of the gems. Now let's see if I get 20. I'll just get 100. Why not? And I didn't even use that many of the gems. Nice. Nice! Now let's warp back home. And actually go through the rest of the recipes because I think that'll be a superior method. Now, 
Ooh, back in here, I can make that last baked fish. Nice. So I don't need to worry about the sunfish anymore, which is super cool. I just need to get um, all my other fish later, but we don't talk about that. And the fried calamari, I can only make one of. So maybe I'll just make one for now and then I don't need to think about it later. And I can still see that there's like one here, you know, you know what I'm saying? Look, that's obviously one. Obviously one. Yeah. Great. So, my second page, I still need a lot of stuff for. And I couldn't get any more of these. So, let's move on to my third page. Alright. So, page three. We are going to need a largemouth bass. And I don't think they're actually that hard to get. So I'm not concerned about that one. And we only need one per recipe. So we're gonna try for three. We have enough wheat flour and enough oil. Pepper poppers. Let me see if I have any pepper poppers in here. Nope. Roots platter. I'm not gonna need that. I'm not gonna need a pumpkin pie yet. I don't want to confuse myself too much by, you know, overloading my pockets with recipes that are in different rows. You know what I'm saying? We don't need stuffing, sashimi, none of that yet. We are going to need trout soup, so I can get one for now. We are going to have chocolate cake. This one tricked us earlier. We're not going to need a survival burger or the rolls yet. Omelets, that's done. Soup's done. These three things were in our other rows, so we don't need that now. What was this? Pale broth. Tomka soup. We need one of that. We don't need any spicy eel yet. That'll be easy to make. And we don't need to worry about that fruit salad. So let's see. Let's see here. So, pepper poppers. One, two, three. Done. Got them. Bread. We can get three bread. Easy. The soup. So, we need more coconut. Coconut's not going to be hard to get at all. And how many do we need? Three of them. Well, I guess we only need two. Because um, we already have one of these soups. And the trout soup, same thing. We're only going to need two of the rainbow trout because we only need two of the recipes we're also gonna need green algae for that so it is good that i got four green algae when i was fishing just now i guess because i can use that for my recipes later chocolate cake how many do we get we have one so now we have three pink cake we need melon for and i saw that we planted melon at my ginger island farm so we can just get some melon from there. We don't have to worry about growing it, which is fantastic. Then a rhubarb pie. Easy, we got three of those. Cookies. Easy. Three cookies. We have all the ingredients for as well, which is the wheat flour, sugar, and egg. And spaghetti, we had wheat flour and tomatoes. So all we need is ingredients for the pink cake. We need one more trout soup. We need, oopsies, we need one more tomka soup, but we need three crispy bass. Ooh, well, I think we'll be fine. Now here, fried eel, we can only get two of. So we're gonna need to get at least one more eel. I have a feeling this one, yeah, the spicy eel. Wait, didn't we have some spicy eel? Let's see. Oop, you know what? Let me empty my pockets out a little bit. I'm starting to get confused here. So we didn't have the crispy bass, but we had pepper poppers. We got bread, the tonka soup. I want to make sure I don't miss anything. So that's why I'm kind of going in order. The trout soup, the chocolate cake, no pink cake. We got rhubarb pie, we got cookies, and we got spaghetti. Where's the spaghetti? See, this is what I'm talking about. Didn't I get three spaghetti? I could have sworn. But now I do. 
Now we know for sure. Three spaghettis. Maybe I'm just getting distracted and don't realize when I when I get them and when I don't. Now moving on, we have two fried eel. And I'm gonna keep that in my pocket for now so I don't mess up the order of anything else. And I can just, you know, review row three all at once. Don't want to forget that I got it. And I'll just put all of this here for now. And I'm not going to need these seeds. Or this fiber. I'm starting to get overwhelmed with my pockets, so. And maybe I'll just keep that, like, right there. So I don't accidentally use it, but I still have it on hand. I'll put this strange bun away. So we do a spicy eel. Nice. So I'll just take three. We must get eel a lot because we have so much spicy eel. Do we have any sashimi? That was usually pretty easy to make. No sashimi in here. We have the rolls. So we have one roll. Hopefully we get more. Two tortillas. Oop, I could have got bread from here. Didn't realize I'd have bread. Let me organize this. Maybe that will help. I don't know. Red plate. What does that look like? Mm -mm 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 -mm. Okay. We have eggplant parmesan. I felt like I saw some in here, right? Yes. Three eggplant parmesans. I don't think we had any rice pudding in here. No, I don't see it. So we got to get stuff for rice pudding and ice cream and blueberry tart. So we got, we have two of these. We have uh, three spicy eels, sashimi. Now we have three. Nice. Let's see the rolls. So we're going to need seaweed. It's so interesting that we don't have that. But I think I keep excess seaweed over here. Down here. Yes, we have a bunch of seaweed. I'll just take 10. Thank goodness, now we don't have to worry about getting seaweed and we can get a whole new uh, recipe made. Here we go. We only needed two more. So I guess I didn't need to take all that, but maybe we'll have to use it for something else. Now we have three tortillas. We're getting a lot from this one. Red plate. We did not have that. Red plate, red cabbage, and radish. Eggplant parm. Wow, we could have made some, but we don't need to because we already have it. The rice pudding is milk, sugar, and rice. That makes sense. And then we get ice cream, which is milk and sugar. Nice. I wasn't sure if we had blueberries or not. I'm so glad we do. It looks like it's the eggs that are our least ingredient from that. Out of blueberry, wheat flour, sugar, and eggs. Which, that's no problem. We'll get three of these. Nice. And now we can put these away. So I think we'll make this chest our first page and the other chest our second page. Okay, so we have two fried eel, three spicy eel, three sashimi, three monkey roll, three tortilla. We have three of the red plate, eggplant parm, three rice pudding three ice cream three blueberry tart three. Oh my god look at that look at that and i think everything will fit in here perfectly right there's only four things we have missing well one two three four hopefully it could it could surprise us and not fit but let's just assume it will now nothing left in our pockets but we could go to page two, and I'm thinking that that might be best. So we're gonna use um, we're gonna use our time today to go through all the recipe lists, make them, and figure out what we need to get. And then next time we're gonna go through and plant things that we need and go fishing. So let's look at this row now. I think this page is going to be a little bit harder. But let's not get intimidated, guys. Let's not get intimidated. Now, we have Autumn's Bounty. One, two, three. You know, I should have checked. <laughs> we had it. I forgot I was doing that. Well, I guess we have plenty. <laughs> Pumpkin soup. Should I check this? 
No pumpkin soup. Super meal. Let's see. We don't need any crab cakes. We don't need eggplant parm. We don't need this. Don't need fruit salad yet. Hash browns. We are going to need a survival burger. Stuffing we're going to need. None of this. None of this. Roots platter. Three. We're not going to need any pumpkin pie yet. Pumpkin soup though. No pina coladas yet. Parsnip soup. Pale broth. Not yet. We're getting close to using all that stuff though. Okay, so... Oh, I was like, where's our stuff? Second page. Here we go. Now we got three of these. Pumpkin soup. You know, a lot of other things disappeared when I got... When I got three of that. So I think we're gonna need more pumpkins pretty soon. Let's see. Super meal. We didn't get any of that yet, so now we have three. Cran sauce. Three of that. Stuffing. So we can make stuffing if we make three more pieces of bread. So I had some more bread here. Why don't we just use that? Then we don't have to use any wheat. Which we have plenty of wheat. But why use it if we don't need to? Okay. So we have that. Um, with bread, cranberries, and hazelnut. Now farmer's lunch. I need more omelets. But I have enough parsnips. So I believe I had an omelet in here. Yeah, over here. So I need two more omelets. Then I can make... Boom! The farmer's lunch. Now I have three farmer's lunch. I have one survival burger. Same thing, bread. I just need some more bread. Nice! I should have just kept bread in here all along. Dun dun dun! I wasn't sure I would get the survival burger, but I'm glad I did. Now, Dish of the Sea, I need sardines for and hash browns. So, I can make the hash browns pretty pretty quick because I still have a lot more potatoes. But I don't have sardines. Now, it looks like I'm going to need six sardines. And there's something else that I needed sardines for. So, this is why I'm glad that I went through the whole recipe list now. Because I might not have realized that I needed more, you know? So, the miner's tree. Didn't I see a miner's tree? Yeah. Yeah. And what else do I need for that? Cave carrot, sugar, and milk. Nice. So I got two more and now I have three. And the last thing was the roots platter, which I are I already have three of, right? Oop, I, I got too many of the survival burgers and stuffing. Oopsies. Okay, so let me check. Where's the roots platter? Here it is. Yeah, I have three already. Now, the only thing that we're going to need from this row is the Dish of the Sea, which we have zero of. But that's great because a lot of these were grayed out and I thought we wouldn't be able to get any of them, but we got a bunch. So let me put them in this chest. Again, Autumn's Bounty, Pumpkin Soup, Super Meal, Cranberry Sauce, Stuffing. Only want three. Oops, that was the burger. Stuffing, Farmer's Lunch. Then the burger. And then we don't have the dish of the sea, so we're just going to go to the miner's treat. And then the roots platter. Great. I'll just put these two in here. We're doing so good. Now we're on to row the next row. Which is, I'll just give you a little, little peekaboo. Here we are on the row ho. Nice. Now let's see if we have anything from here already. We don't have any espresso. Algae soup. Well, we can take three of that. Nice. We already have something done. And we can take three of the pale broth. I wonder if we use the pale broth in any other recipes. It doesn't look like we have the plum pudding. And I don't believe we had any artichoke dip. Or stir fry. Mmm, no roasted hazelnuts. I don't see any. I'm just doing a very fast scan. No pumpkin pie, no radish pie. But we don't have any more pumpkins, I don't think. So we're probably going to have to grow more pumpkins. Here we are. Now I'm going to make three triple shot espressos. And we have all of that. Now, seafoam pudding. It's good that we have the midnight cart because they're a little bit harder to find. But we need flounder. 
And we're only going to need three flounders. I don't think they're too hard to find. Algae soup we have, pale broth we have, plum pudding. So we're going to need wild plum. Let me see if I have some wild plum in excess over here. I think it's fall. Um, yeah, why, why don't I just use these? One, two, three. Okay. Plum pudding. Oh, I needed one. I needed two more. Oops, didn't get enough. Well, that is using a lot more than I wanted, but it's gonna be too hard to get that elsewhere. Hopefully we can make everything in here, but there might be a thing or two that's going to be hard. We might have to wait until another season. So one more of that. So now we have three plum puddings. With wild plum, wheat flour, and sugar. Artichoke dip, we can make three of. Now we don't have any more milk though. And I think that's going to just have to wait until tomorrow if we need more things with milk. Stir fry, nice. We have cave carrot, mushroom, kale, and olive oil or oil. So we got stir fry, roasted hazelnuts. We can only make one of. We need more hazelnuts. I think I could get more. No pumpkin pie. So we're gonna need pumpkin for this, and we're just gonna need three. We're also gonna need more milk, which we're just gonna have to wait on. The radish salad, though, we can make with oil, vinegar, and radish. So we have that done. And let me just check if I have any more hazelnuts. We need three per, and we've made one, so we need six more. Five, six. Yes. Looks like a lot of fall ingredients over in that corner. Roasted hazelnuts. Great. That was a lot we got, actually. We're making a lot more headway than I thought we would. So first we got the triple shot espresso. We don't have the seafood pudding ingredients yet, but we do have the algae soup, the pale broth, the plum pudding. We got the artichoke dip, stir fry, roasted hazelnuts, no pumpkin pie yet, but we have the radish salad. Now we only have two more rows to go through, which is this row and this row. Now, I already know we have some fruit salad because I keep eyeing it. And we do have enough. So we got fruit salad done. We have no blueberry cobbler. No cranberry candy. There's going to be some bread thing. I'm just going to take all this bread. Why not? I'm going to take all the rest of it. We don't have any coleslaw in there. Fiddlehead risotto. No. I'm thinking that there's not going to be a lot more ingredients and in foods cooked here that we haven't made already. This is going to be for a little bit later. This pina colada. Poppy seed muffin. Chowder. What's this? <gasps> the pumpkin pie. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. I forgot. I forgot about the pumpkin pie. So now we only need one pumpkin. But who's just going to make one pumpkin? I'm probably going to make like a whole little forest. There is a chance that I have it already though. Don't forget. Don't you forget. Let's just go and make some. Now we got the fruit salad and we're gonna have blueberry, co blackberry cobbler. Ooh, I wrote, I wrote blueberry, blackberry. And we already had blackberry, sugar, and wheat flour. Then the cranberry candy with cranberries, apple, and sugar. We have that. And I knew we were gonna need bread for this. So I'm glad I put it in my pocket because we need bread, oil, and tomato. Then the coleslaw, luckily I have ingredients for it with cabbage, vinegar, and mayonnaise. Looks like we're, we might need to buy more vinegar eventually. Okay, so I think I might have enough fiddlehead ferns over here. Let me check. Fiddlehead fern, where are you? Yeah. Let me just take this whole bundle and that one. There might be something else that I needed it for too. I can't remember. Cool. So I have three. Then I'm going to need some poppies for this. That is going to be a little bit harder. But I think maybe I can make them... I think I have some extra space in my greenhouse. That might be perfect for this. But I will need to put some sprinklers around there. Um, and I'll probably end up making more than three poppies. Maybe I'll just do like six. Just in case. 
but I only need three. Then this one, okay, so I just need more milk for chowder. Okay. And then the fish stew I need mussels for, and mussels will be easy to get to. Honestly, I'm surprised I don't have any. I think I used them for some other, uh, like, challenge I was doing, though. I only need three. As cargo I can make right now, though. Why not? Why not make it? So the only thing we need from this row are poppy seed muffins, chowder, and fish stew. And the chowder and fish stew are going to be really easy. This one, the poppy, is just going to take longer to grow. Which is no big deal. So we have fruit salad, blackberry cobbler, the cranberry candy, bruschetta, is that how you say it? Somebody help me. The coleslaw. Oops. Then we have the fiddlehead risotto. No poppy seed muffin, no chowder, no fish stew yet, but we have escargot. We're doing great. Now we have this last row here. And I think this one, we're not going to have some of the stuff for quite yet. Like the lobster. Lobster takes a little bit longer to get. But I think I have a plan for it. So we don't have anything for the lobster. We don't have the maple bars in here. No crab cakes. No shrimp cocktail. Do we have ginger ale? Nope, no ginger ale. All right. Banana pudding. I don't see it anywhere. No mango sticky rice. Look at that. See, we don't have like anything. Soup, the poi. Is that how you say that? Tropical curry. Doesn't look like any of that. And squid and ravioli. So, but where does this come from? Because I did not see a pina colada like anywhere on my list. And I feel like it would be a cooked item. Pina colada. See, I don't see it anywhere here. It's so cute though and cool. Maybe it's a food that you can only like buy and you can't make it. I don't know. So we can't make this. Ooh, we do have enough lobster, but we don't have the milk. Maple bar we can make. I like that. Crab cakes. Nice. We have enough crab, wheat flour, egg, and oil. Great. Shrimp cocktail. Ooh, interesting one. We have enough shrimp. We don't have a wild horseradish. So there's a chance I have some whatever season it comes in. Yeah. I think I only needed three. So let's see if I can make the shrimp cocktails now. I knew it was great to store all this random stuff in my house. And we made it. We're going to need some ginger. I don't know where I usually keep my ginger. I could have sworn I had a lot more. But it looks like I only have two pieces of ginger. And we're going to need three per. So we need like seven more. But I might just end up collecting a whole bunch and keeping them. Ooh, okay. So the banana pudding we can actually make a bunch of. But again, it's the freaking milk. <laughs> I just, I used all of my milk. Okay, mango sticky rice we need coconut for. And I, I already have a mission to get more coconut in general. So that's going to be totally fine. And we're going to need three of them. Okay, so the poi soup. Poi. Hmm. We need taro root for. Taro root grows pretty, pretty easily because I could just put it by a water source. So maybe I'll put it like on my farm kind of around that little pond on the bottom and grow it that way or i could do it on my ginger island farm and do it that way so i'm going to need 12 more because i don't have any tropical curry i'm going to need more pineapple which i do have growing so that's going to be really easy i only need two more pineapples because i have one but the coconut i'm also going to need so i need six and squid ink ravioli, I got lucky with having enough tomatoes and squid ink. Done. I got them. So I was kind of right where this bottom row, we really don't have a lot of anything. And surprisingly, it was mostly because of the milk. So tomorrow morning, once I get the milk and I get the coconuts, I'm going to have a lot more stuff that I can make. So... No lobster bisque, we have the maple bar, we've got the crab cakes, we've got the shrimp cocktail, no ginger ale, no banana pudding, no mango sticky rice, no poi, 
No tropical curry, but we have squid and gravioli. That's where the pancakes went. Oh my god. I knew I made them. I knew I made them. You see? You see? So, we're gonna get a bunch more milk in here eventually. And things will be a lot happier. I'll be happier. I'll be a happy lady. I don't know where this came from though. Pina colada. It's driving me crazy. Crazy. And there's a life elixir and oil of garlic that we don't put over there either, which is quite interesting. So we went through all of these food recipes and we've cooked quite a bit of food as you can see. Now we have something missing from every single row and our second row here, we have about half of them missing. And then the bottom row on the last page, we also have about half of them missing. But all of the rest of the rows, we're doing pretty good at. And once we get more milk and um, more milk, and what was the other thing I said? More milk and coconuts. We're going to be in a much better place. So I'm going to end it here. In our next video, we're going to go through and actually collect these items. Get more of our milk and everything else that I said that we need. And we're going to be cooking up more recipes. All right. Thank you so much for visiting my channel and staying until the end of the video. I hope that you enjoyed watching as much as I enjoyed playing. And I will see you in our next video.